What's going on guys? Danny, Lanier Lawn Care. I'm sure you know who I am by now. Um, today we're going to go over the unboxing and overview of our first thoughts of this new blower from DeWalt that they're coming out with. This, I believe, is now available along with the trimmer and the Poe Hedge trimmer in Home Depot. Uh, we'll give you some prices of this, go over some features of this and some specifications. So stay tuned. Let's get into this unboxing. So, uh, let's unbox this thing, <laughs> show you all what it comes with. So, of course, it's going to come with a charger, a battery. I'm going to set this on the floor here. So, the battery of this, uh, this is going to come with a five-hour battery. So, unlike the uh, pole hedge trimmer, um, it came with a four-amp hour. So, this kit comes with a five-amp hour battery. Then you get the charger, of course. Some... Uh, burn materials to start a good fire with later. <coughs> your paperwork, manual, and then you get your tubing. All right. Well, it's light without the tube on. So we've got our uh, back here where the battery goes. Then this is of course where the air pulls in. Looks like they got some kind of turbine engine going on here. Give us some uh, speed, <laughs> speed lightning. All right, let's click this bad boy into place. There we go. And it clicked. All right, so there is a tight fit there, which is kind of good because I really don't want all this air released out. And then we've got our turbo nozzle, as they call it. And we'll go over the specifications of this stuff. <laughs> our turbo nozzle, put that up. So what this is, if you need it, it says save these instructions. So apparently we need it. All right, so then we've got the turbo nozzle. The turbo nozzle just clicks on the end here, and it looks like it uh, actually, looks like it actually has a place to click into different positions. Oh, no, it don't, okay. So if you wanna take it off, you literally just push these sides in and then pull this off. So, uh, all right, let's go over some specifications of this. We'll throw a battery in this and uh, see what we think about it. This only weighs 5.43 pounds uh, without a battery. And then when you add the battery, of course, you add that extra pound, a little over a pound. <coughs> so it's still very light. And the one thing I really like about this is it's very comfortable in your hands and it's very lightweight. And then you've got, also you've got a variable speed trigger. So not only do you have the trigger, but then you've got like how most have a cruise control. So you can just lock it into place. That's real nice as well. So as you notice, we move it, the trigger moves. Um, then we've got the, con this is called the concentrated nozzle. And so um, <clears throat> this is gonna do, let's get into this. This does 450 CFM and 125 mile per hour with the concentrated nozzle. Now, I couldn't find any specs on what miles per hour was without the concentrated nozzle. But it don't say nothing about the CFM going down. It literally just says that with the nozzle, you get the 125. Um, so without the nozzle, not sure what that's going to amount to or if that's going to affect the CFM any at all. But we've got a, we've got a five amp hour battery here. We're gonna throw in this. Um, this is supposed to be low noise. So it's supposed to only put out 66 decibels which is very low. So uh, we're gonna see what this does compared to how this sounds, I guess. Um, and then, you know, we'll leave the concentrated nozzle on it because variable speed trigger, it is. It 
This is very quiet. I'll give it that. Seems to blow some dust around it. <clears throat> so it does blow pretty decent um, to be what it is, especially. So this is definitely a, a like, I mean, I could see myself using this if I'm on a smaller property or uh, the one thing that stops me from using most battery powered blowers like this is the grass that accumulates under my truck while I'm mowing. Um, after I get done, I go to blow all that grass out of the street back into the lawn and I haven't found a blower, handheld, battery anyway, that would blow all of that by me just literally walking without me having to put majority of this tubing under my truck to get it completely blown out. And then even if I do that, it really don't push it over that curb um, to get it back into the line like an actual gas powered blower does. So we'll see how well this works once season starts. But uh, this is just an overview, yeah, overview for y'all to show you pretty much what, what it is how it works and tell you the specifications about this. Um, once again, this is released. I'm pretty sure you can go to Home Depot, pick this up right now. If you was to get this uh, with the kit, you're looking at $199. And then if you get it without the uh, kit, just the bare tool, it's $139. So comment down below, let me know. Do you think you would spend $140 uh, because I'm not sure how long this battery will last. It comes with a five amp hour battery. Yes, there are bigger batteries, which do add more weight, but I'm kind of curious to see how long this five amp hour battery lasts once it's fully charged and uh, how much runtime we can actually get being on high, just let it run and see what, what the battery life comes to on that to see how well or how many of these batteries we would probably need throughout the day. But uh, that's going to do it for this one, guys. If you have any question about the new 20 volt uh, brushless blower from DeWalt, then uh, comment down below. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, smash that subscribe button as we got more videos coming your way.